Hey guys, so I have been loving chicken lately, so I'm going to show you guys my favorite recipe for chicken kebabs. This produces the most flavorful, juiciest chicken kebabs ever. So I'm using chicken breast instead of chicken thighs because I like chicken breast, I don't like chicken thighs. It's up to you um, and I'm just trimming the fat off of them, make sure you do that and I'm cutting up them up in like bigger chunks um, just so they're going on a grill. So now I'm going to clean my chicken and I'm just going to add some salt. I'm salting this nicely and I'm also going to add some vinegar um, because we want to get rid of those like stringy sort of like fibrous things that you find sometimes with chicken. So all that yucky stuff, we're just going to soak it in some vinegar and salt. You can also use lime juice for this, but uh, white vinegar is what I had in, on hand and it works just fine. And I'm also adding some water because we don't want it to taste like vinegar. We just want to sort of soak the chicken and make sure it's nicely cleaned. While the chicken is soaking, we're going to work on our marinade and I'm just adding a spoonful of mayonnaise. And now I'm just adding some stone ground mustard, just a little bit, about a teaspoon or half of a teaspoon even. And now I'm gonna add some cayenne pepper, ground ginger, some allspice, ground cumin, smoked paprika. Now did y'all know they make squeezable sour cream? I had no idea, I feel so late. It was just so doggone cute, so I had to get it. So I got some sour cream in there. And of course, I'm gonna add some Creole seasoning, some red pepper flakes, some soy sauce, and we're just gonna mix this up nicely. And I'm also gonna add some olive oil. Now, this is the part where you start adding salt if you need to. I did sprinkle in a little more salt, and then I did add some freshly cracked black pepper. Make sure you just really taste this and make sure you're happy with the salt and that nothing is too much or too little. You can always add a little bit more of everything. I added some more cayenne because I really like heat. And I also added some minced garlic not shown in the video. Um, just whatever works for your flavor buds. So I drained my chicken and now I'm just adding it back to my marinade. And we're just gonna mix this up nicely and then cover this up to marinate for about eight hours to even overnight so now I'm just sort of um, putting my skewers together and they, these were pre-soaked so now I'm just putting my chicken in there and we are pretty much ready to hit the grill make sure you save some of that mixture to um, sort of baste while you're grilling so I am using a grilled topper and I'm just really greasing that generously to make sure that none of the chicken sticks and I'm going to put this, put my um, skewers, my kebabs on this and grill it. So by the time I got to grilling these, it was really dark and cold, but um, I hope you guys like this video. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time.